Yes, I'm one of those people who keeps shoes. I always tell my mom it's my profession, or I tell my husband it's my profession, I need to have these shoes. I have many, many shoes. Even if I don't wear them, I like to have them around. I don't travel with less than, I would say, nine pair of shoes. There are shoes, though, that I don't pack because I don't want anything to happen to the shoes. I'm a girl who loves shoes, first and foremost. You know, my shoes, I wear them till they get split up and beat up. It's hard for me to let go of shoes. Yes, I have a really great shoe closet. Sometimes I do shoe stocking. I do. <laughs> I talk to my shoes. Or if I see a really cute pair at a store, I'll just ask them do they need a home. And they'll talk to me. She loves shoes. I would say she has a shoe fetish. No less than 300 pairs of shoes at home. 600. I know girls who wear high heels at home. <laughs> I do wear heels every day. People have tried to buy these shoes off my feet. It's a primal response that women are having. Even if they're not going to wear it, they want it. They're my lovers, my everyday lovers. I don't know. These don't have a name yet. And I don't want to name them Jaws. That wouldn't be it. People that work around me in my house, like personal assistants and so on, I never hire anyone that wears the same size shoe as me. <laughs> Tall woman, old woman, young woman, no matter what, you could take that same fabulous pair of size eight whatevers and they all get to be Cinderella. Every night before I leave, I check every single light and make sure everything is off and I say good night to my shoes. Yeah, 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 yeah. I love them to death. Yeah, yeah, God save my shoes.